Hello, welcome to my channel. This is Renee. If you are not a subscriber, I wish you would consider subscribing. Today I'm participating in a tablescape challenge, Falling into Harvest. This is being hosted by Shangi, Living Life to the Fullest. Co-hosts are Gigi Fajian, V of Timeless Elegance by V, Marilyn of Fabulous Designs on a Budget, and Tammy at Me, Myself, and DYI in it. And I hope I didn't miss anyone. Also, there will be a link for these channels in the description box. So this is my interpretation of a Fallen into Harvest tablescape. I believe one of the rules was not to use any orange pumpkins, so I found these uh, white gourds at Ross's. And I decided to go with pretty much a neutral palette today. And I found the um, charger at Hobby Lobby's. For some of the um, other items I already had that I've used in some previous tablescape. And I found my vase at Big Lots. And the greenery I've had from just years ago, I had used it in a vase and I had it in my living room area. I'm going to move around a little bit so you can see another view of my tablescape. I tried to add a little bit more lighting as well. I have some LED lights under my tray. And I got this tray from Burlington probably about a month ago. I think the little white lantern actually came from the Dollar General store. And my pillow was from Pier One Imports. I believe that's what it's called. It's been out of business now for a while in my area, but I believe it's Pier One Imports. And I believe the throw is actually a runner, a table runner that I got from them as well. Now this painting is uh, just a little project that my grandson and I put together using some black uh, spray paint and some um, white and then we added um, I think some glue and some glitter later on. But it's been a while since I've done this. Uh, now I don't do a lot of projects. I do like to paint a little bit, and that is something that I started when I was in college. That was back in the 80s. I had to take several classes for art for teachers. 
but I'm so glad I got to participate in this tapescape challenge today. I've been extremely busy with virtual school with my grandson. Now in the comments below, I'd like for you to uh, comment whether you have children or grandkids still in school and whether they are actually physically going to school or are they participating in some form of virtual school. In my area, the kids uh, started back to school several weeks ago. So some of them go two days a week, and then they have virtual school for two days. But because of health reasons, since I'm a stroke survivor, I decided to not send my grandson to school since he stays with me, and we've just been doing virtual school at home. But I'd like to um, thank Shangi before I end my video for hosting this today. I'd like to thank the other co-hosts as well. Well, I hope you have enjoyed my video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.